I can't go anywhere without my cell phone. Being able to have a choice is a good thing to everybody. I have a two-year-old son who already knows how to use my tablet and my cell phone. So much has changed. Back in 1999, the CCK was set up to license and regulate Kenya's communications industry. Everything from cell phone services, internet access, broadcasting and e-commerce were radically improved over the CCK's 15-year life. The CCK has now completed its mission, but under the new constitution, a new body has been set up to continue its work. Unlike the CCK, the Communications Authority of Kenya is completely independent of government. It's also free from any commercial or political interest. The rebranding is itself a symbolic and an institutional uh, statement that the constitutional prescription of an independent regulator has now taken effect. As we start to unveil ourselves, let us be reminded of our set vision to promote consumer interests and fair play in this dynamic sector. A new logo has been adopted to underscore the change. What we tried to do with the logo is, we said let's take the arrow to show that Kenya is moving forward, Kenya is progressing. And more arrows to mean that we're actually fast forwarding, it's coming from different directions. This is also being driven into a sort of convergence because we're trying to show that the communication is coming towards the country and it's coming towards us at pace. When we chose the colors, the main colors we chose were blue and black. Black to symbolize the people, of course, the Africanness of it, and also mainly because of the authority and power. And then we chose blue because of technology and to also give a symbolic feel towards calmness, a whole idea of the harmony and the calmness within which we operate. When it came to the background color, which is white, it's there mainly because of the fairness and transparency the organization represents. The rebranding is more than skin deep. The entire culture of the organization is being re-engineered. Why exactly do we want to change? The Director General, who is the leader, is Nick Deb himself, the chief champion, has been very categorical that uh, he wants to see a change. I think the rebranding part, which people are very excited about, is a good raw materials in terms of actually helping accelerate the culture. We are able now to piggyback around the rollout of the new brand in terms of saying that we also need to look at success inside so that we look as good as the brand and the logos which we see from the outside. We're moving from the old way of doing things to a new dispensation that has been defined by many parameters from a delivery of work and how we treat our clients and how we facilitate business in the ICT sector in Kenya. It's not just going to be a window dressing, it's going to be real change and transformation not only to the Communications Authority of Kenya but to Kenya as a whole. For us, it's not a one-time thing. It's a commitment into a new future. The Communications Authority of Kenya would want to see Wanjiku accessing more of these services, using it affordably. We also want to see uh, Wanjiku in Kenya seeing ICT as part of what is going to energize her to be able to achieve the social economic development. The majority of the population is actually youth and the youth have an independence that we didn't have. And they actually then have the opportunity to push all the boundaries that you possibly can imagine, uh, both in the development curve, uh, making sure that they're creating new applications for further communication. The population now is able to transfer knowledge across the board and across the country. The excitement of the 47 counties also starts to legitimize the opportunity for development in those counties. With the developments that have happened in this country on the ICT side, with the laying of fiber optic that now have enabled even institutions that were in the rural to be able to access internet services, it's different from what it was, very different. Now we expect that even in the very near future, it will even be better. Today is a Kenyan has totally changed, a different animal. We're dealing with people who are more aggressive, more driven, and more entrepreneurial. Based on that, the process they want to move forward is a leap, not a step. They want to jump forward. And CCK has given us a great foundation for that. 
And now as Communications Authority of Kenya, they have greater capacity and a greater mandate to be able to do that on a much, much wider scale. My children are going to live in a knowledge-based economy, an information-driven environment. The access to the internet uh, means that uh, the whole world of information opens up before them. We shall have a better Kenya. The promises are good, the efforts being made are good, and I trust that it's our duty at our levels to ensure it happens.